this is Ajit Kumar and in this video we will talk about how we can copy any data to Azure storage easily so this is the storage account okay so we plan to upload this file copy this file to a storage account so in this video we will know about that so for that you just go to uh, google and uh, search for the download as a copy so basically we need to download this uh, setup which is basically a is it copy setup so there is a multiple uh, type is available like for windows 64 bit and 32 and for the linux os and the mac os as well so in my case i have uh, windows 64 bit so i'm going to download this okay so after that you just go to that folder as you can see it's downloaded in the zip file we need to extract that so this is the file so you just need to copy that and go to the windows system 32 and paste it here so since like oh, i have already copied here so let me replace that so as you can see here the setup is copied successfully so after that you just go to the storage account and here in the container so as of now i have not created any uh, container this is the container existing earlier so i'm going to create a container name copy okay so this is the container name you need to go to the container where you want to copy that your data and after that go to the access policy sorry the properties and here you need to copy this url basically so let me open a new notepad copy that and after that you just go to the storage account here in the drop down you will get shared access signature you need to go there and after that you just check the allow resources type so as you can see i check that and here you can uh, means uh, maximize the timing for the sas key generally we are uh, creating here the sas key so what you are using the protocol so it will let me check the second option it will allow https and http both so i'm going to create a sas token here so here is a sas token let me copy that so here you need to uh, copy basically you need to copy here only okay so i have copied that and after you just go to the command prompt and run as administrator so since uh, my exit copy is in, is in path system 32 so you will get easily and after that mention here the copy here we will mention the source location source path which we want to upload so just copy that path in between that and after that you just mention that access key along with the sas and here you need to put the hyphen hyphen recursive let me enter that so as you can see here my file is downloaded number of file 
transferred four and number of file transferred completed okay and total size of the file transferred and final job status as you can see here completed let me go to that storage and check the container the if the file is available or not so as you can see here this is my container now the folder is uploaded along with the file these are the file available so this is all about how we can copy or upload your file from your local drive to azure storage easily so thanks for watching this channel and please subscribe my channel and like this video and if you have any query please comment in the section i will happy to answer that thank you so much